Vivi. Um, so, uh, so this anime I, uh, is an original anime, and the only reason why it probably got made um, is probably because the author of um, ReZero was involved. Um, have you seen ReZero, Fahrenheit? No, I haven't. Good. Uh, it's it's a really bad isekai with a really annoying protagonist. Um, and um, so I, I didn't ha- have really high expectations for this uh, this show. Um, and I just ignored it back, back when, it, when it came out in 2021 or whenever. Um, until uh, I saw a, a clip by... Um, by Gigak, where he was saying that uh, it's actually not shit, and well, uh, I, th- I think he was he was kind of right. Um, so uh, I I guess a lot of people expected it to get to get more att- attention that season. I remember, but like uh, nobody cared. M- maybe it's because it's sci-fi, and I don't know. Anime fans don't care about sci-fi that much these days. Um, it's it's not uh, it's not like uh, back in, back in the Astro Boy days, uh, is it? <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, yeah, but but but, yeah. but but I guess I guess uh, this whole thing of um, AI with human feelings and whatnot uh, it's uh, very much in the DNA of anime. Given that the whole of anime and manga, given that the whole thing. Got started with um, with Astro Boy, after all. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm wondering, you know, what if like a like sweet brand like sponsored Vivi? Do you you know? Do you think it would do any you know any better? You know, if like if like halfway through the series they started like promoting like you know you know confectionery items. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I I remember I remember um, there was an anime. With superheroes, a superhero anime where like where like all, all the superheroes were, uh, like they were promoted by Coca Cola or something like within the story itself. So I don't know. Uh, yeah, uh, I, well, I, I guess I, I guess can, in terms of yeah. Yeah, you uh, can get away with it with stuff like uh, Code Geass, where they uh, <laughs> they they are masterfully integrated their uh, pizza commercials. Into- there are pizza commercials I mean, in the show. Um, uh, I mean, uh, the, the, if they could have gotten anyone for a commercial in this case, I think uh, it should have probably been uh, Disneyland because we all know that uh, that place called the D- Land or whatever is just supposed to be uh, Disneyland, the theme park where Vivi uh, works at. Yeah. <laughs> um, and given that it's such a big deal for the plot as well, so. This is this is uh, an AI artificial intelligence anime. Uh, you, you know, um, it's about robots and whatnot, uh, like um, like like Ghost in the Shell or something. But but it's it's also it's also an, an idol um, idol show. Um, and I don't know. I think some of the songs were not bad, like uh, the last song song that Vivi sings. And um, on YouTube, at least, I saw that. Um, some of the songs um, from the anime have a couple of um, m- million views, but uh, I don't know. Uh, I, th- I thought that the character designs and the music uh, were both kind of generic. Um, they-, they were not as catch- catchy as, um, I don't know, a-, a proper idol show or, or whatever uh, you-, you want to say. Um, yeah, they- yeah. Um, I think... I d- yeah, I didn't think any of the songs were bad. Um, I kind of think I don't know. They just I didn't really like remember any of them apart from like maybe the um, opening song. Um, you know, I think there were. I think that's just because they, they, she like sings a bit of English, <laughs> and that, and, that, and and that's the reason why like like um, I remember it. So uh, um, I don't know. The in- the uh, I thought I thought the intro was was, was pretty good. Um, anyway. But um, yeah, I mean, like none no, of the songs really like stood out too much. It's not really about the idol show though that much. Um, it's more like I, I don't really know what it is. It's, it's um, it's like it's sort of like a time traveling mystery, um, like thriller. Uh, but 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 they don't really travel in time. They they like, travel in time twice. Um, 
yeah, I don't know. I think I'm kind of explaining it all wrong, but uh, there is there is a way that they don't travel in time. It's constantly. like the Terminator. It, it's like the Terminator. <laughs> yeah, it, it is. But um, I will. I think um, I'll I'll give this show credit, right? Because I didn't really find much of a problem in like with, with the writing. Um, in that it actually made a lot more sense than a lot more sense than the Terminator. Um, they did a good job of explaining why. You know, where Masamoto um, couldn't just um, travel back in time constantly and eventually get it right, like one what, what other times. Because, yeah, I, I mean, it, it's sort of, I don't, I don't want to like spoil it straight away, but um, they, I found that they, that they explain why that's the, the case quite um, well. And then, and then later on, like, surely, surely, if like the AI, um, if like the main central AI, I, I, I forgot what they call it. Um, I think, yeah, I, think we, yeah. I think we should really start from the beginning, actually. Um, but yeah, like um, the important thing I, I want to say is that the writing was pretty good, um, actually. Um, even though I, I mean, I thought it was I thought it was going in, in a certain direction, but they sort of surprised me. Um, yeah, which, which is something I'm direction? definitely going to credit for. What, what was the direction you thought it was going to go? I thought it's like <laughs> so at, at the start, I was I was under, I was under the impression that like. If we don't like liberalize, then AIs will like kill everyone. <laughs> I thought I thought like that was the angle they were going for, and I was like, okay, this doesn't really make a lot of sense. Um, but uh, they sort of um, take it in like a more interesting direction. Um, it, yeah, I mean, it, it it wasn't like this show doesn't really advocate for a lot, um, which is kind of nice. Um, the like the word points where I thought characters were just saying like stupid stuff. Um, <laughs> Like there's this there's this sort of like um funny part of like right at the end where the doctor um I forget his name but um Matsumoto yeah 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 right. Do- Do- Doctor Matsumoto um he like he he like after like after like an AI sort of, like killed everyone he still says oh yeah I'm 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 in favour of coexistence by the way with with, with AI it, it just it just sort of felt like so like silly um. <laughs> But he's like I sort of understood why he like he, he felt that, but um, even though it was sort of I think flawed reasoning, there's like a bit of there's a fair bit of flawed reasoning in the show, or at least reasoning that's kind of hard to follow. But it doesn't really matter that much. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so I remember when I said that uh, this might remind you of another show we talked about. Uh, so you know which show I was talking about, right? Yes, the time time of Eve. Yes, of course. Though, well, yeah. this this is much better than Time of Eve. Um, <laughs> at least, at least the CG is. Um, a, a, apart from the like Minecraft, um, like hover bikes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. The, yeah. That's very really shitty. Um. Yeah. Some of the action scenes look really um good, but they're pretty short. Like they last just a few seconds or maybe a minute. Also, and then it gets back to like pretty pretty average looking animation. Um, it's by Studio Vit, um, which I, if I'm not mistaken, that's uh, Attack on Titans um, um, studio, anime studio. If mistaken. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, uh, before uh, the animation went to shit or something. I, yeah, well, I well, a bit yeah. Um, because um, it went it went over to Mapper. Yeah. Um. So uh, what I was most worried. At the start, um, and I guess it's, this is also a, a, a difference with t- time of um, Eve, which is like a small story which covers a small period of time in a few episodes. Whereas, uh, so what, what I was worried about here instead is because um, uh, the story covers uh, a period of 100 years, but it's only 13 episodes long, um, and I was worried that it would become a mess with the time skips, but it didn't really matter. Um, that much um they did a good job with that um okay uh yeah I guess well, we, could... we could we 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 could start at the very beginning or sort of sort of um, explain who and um, is or um, or who a diva is um she's basically like a idol ai uh so sort of like androids um who's um whose goal is to make everyone happy with her singing <laughs> um <laughs> You know, uh, you know. Um, she, she she could be a Disney princess or something. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, she could yeah. be. Um, she didn't obviously. She she doesn't really age. Um, though I think I I think they did do like with her character. 
she does like change and uh, mature um, as as the series goes on. I think they did a kind of a good job. Um, but yeah, like we we could talk about how the AI's overall sort of change in, in subtle ways as, as the show goes on. Um, but anyway, uh, she um, she works in Disneyland and <laughs> and um, every day she sings to about like about like two dozen people. Um, but you know that that that's okay for her because eventually she's sort of destined to become like a mega star idol, you know. But um, anyway, she um, she she does this as, as her day job. Um, but um, she gets she, she she gets interrupted by a time traveling AI from the future called uh, Mas- called um, Matsumoto. Um, he um, appears as like a teddy bear, which which is kind of cute. Um, and he tells her like that um, if if time isn't changed a certain way, eventually all AI are going to like are going to uh, wipe out humanity basically. Um, so she agrees because you know it's within her um, her sort of um, her parameters, right? Well, you know if um, if all people are dead, then she can't sing to them. So <laughs> so she has no choice but to help out Matt, but to help out to Matsumoto. Um, yeah, and then and and then we have like a few cute scenes where she like where she like chases around like a teddy bear because she thinks like Matsumoto is like like a virus and, and stuff. But um, eventually, yeah, Matsumoto like proves to her that he is from the future, and then they begin their journey together um, into uh, a, a a like one hundred year journey <laughs> um, to to try to stop um, AI from, from wiping out like from wiping out humanity, um, and that's basically what the series is about. Yeah, uh, yeah. I- uh and um but they're not uh, they're not together throughout uh, those 100 years um matsumoto just uh, shows up um as uh, sp- specific moments um which are important in the development of um, ai or whatever uh in history um to to, to try to change those moments um yeah, and well um they, they are usually against uh, a, a group called uh, Toak, or um, who also uh, who who are a terrorist group um, who want to destroy AI, which is kind of strange. You would think that they would work together from the start, um, given that <laughs> their their goal is the same. Um, but but I guess not. Um, um, what else? Uh, yeah, that that's basically the premise. I guess we could talk about. I mean, there's only th- thirteen episodes, so. Uh, yeah, yeah. One of one of the things I also sort of compared it to in my head um, was Gunbuster, um, main, mainly because of the time skips. Um, even though Gunbuster has even less episodes, I kind of I kind of think a better job was done there to put across um, like the the passing of time. Um, I think they like um, some attempts were made, right? Um, with like follow through characters, like um, there's like there's like like w- one of the main um, antagonists is 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 like Yugo, um, Kaki um, Tani. Tani. Yeah, 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 Kaki Tani. Um, and you can see him sort of get older. Um, from from like being kids, he's like he's like evolution. You know, you know, um, just a kid net worth twelve dollars to cyborg badass. Um, net worth um two k or I don't know like two million. Uh, which, uh, which which is um I wish I wish they kind of developed him a little bit more. He kind of um I think that was sort of a missed opportunity there. Um but he does he does get some character stuff. Um but I don't know. I d I didn't really feel that, that that like his passing or his life really had much of a like emotional um impact on, on anything really. Um I think that's more like a plot device, yeah. Yeah. Um did you see the the short seen um I, I, i'm not sure whether it was after credits but the, the one where they explain uh his backstory with um his quote-unquote teacher ai who taught him piano um, yes yes yeah yeah um, yeah, um I, I guess the whole thing with him was that he he just didn't like ai because they didn't um just obey his orders or whatever, <laughs> and they they just kept sacrificing yeah. themselves for his sake or something. Um, yeah, yeah, they're like playing mind games on. Yeah, like, they're like playing mind games on um, on him. They're doing like psychic attacks. 
but yeah, I mean, um, I kind of, I kind of do get the like the uh, comparisons to to Ghost in the Shell. Like you do sort of see it sometimes, where like <laughs> even even though she's like a uh, like idle robot, she she can also be like really good at fighting, <laughs> and she yeah, can like jump from jump from like the like the fifty story of like a building and and survive fine. Um, it's like it's like what like what what on earth was was she like built for? I mean. <laughs> This is this, yeah, this, this I mean, doesn't seem like a regular idle like AI robot really. I mean, it's, I mean, it's kind of um, I don't know. It it was like a little bit jarring. Um, it didn't really make a lot of sense. The fact that she would be able to like overpower like security robots, for example. Um, they they try to they try to excuse it by um, like say, saying that like Matsumoto installed a special <laughs> c- combat <laughs> program into her firmware or something. But, yeah, uh, yeah, I, yeah. It did kind of feel like just an excuse to have like uh, um, action scenes, uh, martial martial arts scenes, and whatnot um, with AI. Uh, well, in Ghost in the Shell, that's a good explanation as to why. Uh, whereas here, um, okay, so so um, what do you say? Shall we go through the plot uh, episode by episode, or? Do we have any I don't other, know. Yeah. I don't know about that. Um, I think I I think we should talk about because because like most like most of these plots are sort of like small small story arcs, which are um, which um, revolve around key moments in in history that theoretically leads to all humans eventually getting killed by AI, right? So so they so when Vivi or a diva and a Masanoto have to change these events in time to then stop um, all humans from dying, basically. Um, so I think uh, actually I don't know we I guess I I guess we like may as well. Um, who's the um who's the first? Yeah, like what what's the first moments um in a show that has to be changed? Is it um is it like um, um the Estella's? representative? It's, yeah, it's yeah. The, it, the, uh, the representative from the the government, uh, Aikawa or whatever his name. Um, oh right, yeah, the uh, like AI naming um act low. something. Yeah, yeah, the, AI the, the AI So yeah, so there's this politician trying to pass a law, um, a gra- <laughs> to, um which would give um, AI uh, human rights or whatever. Um, but they just <laughs> end, they, they just end up ma- making it worse uh, because in the original timeline he he's just uh, he's just a grifting politician who doesn't care about it one way or the other, and he's just trying to. Um, get some votes from the AI industries. Uh, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> by su- supporting uh, this AI law, but then um, because Vivi saves him, he becomes an un- ironically um, a true believer in AI. I guess. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Uh, I guess. Um, I mean. Um, yeah. About that arc, what I like the most. Um, other than the over the top uh, action scenes, was like how, like uh, uh, right after uh, Matsu- Matsumoto uh, and uh, and Vivi, uh, like after having saved the the, uh, the representative, they shake hands um, and like they have uh, this little cute moment where like Vivi has to like um, um, or rather Ma- Matsumoto asks um, Vivi to um, kneel down or something because uh, to reach uh, his hand and. Then the next shot um, is uh, <laughs> um, um, Matsumoto beating up um, Vivi with a remote, remote-controlled um, crane AI or something um, because to, to stop her from trying to change the the timeline um, uh, because they, they, they are only allowed to change certain things in the timeline and. Um, um, basically, uh, a, a passenger aircraft was going to explode mid-air, and uh, um, Vivi's number one fan, uh, or rather Div- Divas, uh, yeah, we could talk about her name um, as well. Um, number one fan is on uh, the a little girl is on the p- passenger aircraft. Um, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Um. So yeah, like she's like a like a, a very young girl who um who says you know who's like very very kind to Diva, you know she's um she's basically like this like younger sister to her, 
um, in, 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 in a way. But um, in the timeline, she she sort of dies, right? You know, she dies in a plane crash. Um, and this also happens in, in, in this timeline um, as well. Um, because, um, you know, because of, because of, there's like risks t- attached to just need, like needlessly changing the timeline um, if, if you don't have to. So, so there's this very sort of um, emotional scene where, um, yeah, where, um, where Momoka um, dies basically in a, a plane crash. Um, I thought um, it was one of the moments that I was like a little bit too um, over, like, overdone. Yeah. Um, like, like, like um, how she like looks out of the plane and like <laughs> Dee was looking back, and then I don't know. It was... <laughs> <laughs> and then they sort of like, like keep referencing it over and over again for, for the whole series. Is it, is it, is it, um, is it like uh, that moment in, in Re Zero? Uh, yeah, uh, like that. That's actually what I was thinking of. This like, <laughs> there were though it was it was and, much and again, again, in Re Zero. And again, it, and, and uh, again, it's Fate a, Zero. And again, it's a passenger um, aircraft again. It is. Um, all these like plane <laughs> accidents. You just like you just not not like. Just, just don't get into planes. I mean, you're just sort of asking for it. <laughs> Especially if you're, if you're in an anime, don't get into well, planes. Well, yeah, exactly, exactly. If um, if it's like a, a anime with like a with like a a ton of lens flare, then you should actually absolutely not be going into passenger aircraft. Um, um so that so the title of um of um um the anime, which as you said before we started recording, um, is a barrier to entry. Um, yes. It's uh, Vivi's Fluorite Ice Song, um, <laughs> <laughs> and um, maybe maybe it sounds better in like the original Japanese or something. I don't know. Um, hmm. uh, let, let, I think I think it's the same in Japanese as well. Let me check on Mal. We should say oh, no. so. Um, because, and I, the I reason why I, th- I think it's it's the same is that. Um, um. You, you, yeah, I think it's the same. Yeah, it is the same because uh, it's uh, ri- ri- written in um, katakana, which means that. Uh, um, oh yeah, it's like phonetic. Is that what it means? Yeah. Or something interesting. Okay. So, and uh, in yeah, a way so, that that makes it even more like esoteric. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, and uh, so so it's also um, the the name of um, of the song which. Um, Vivi sings at the end to save the world or something, uh, and uh, this is nothing nothing new to anime. If you have seen Macross, that's basically what Macross is. Um, <laughs> uh, idols uh, sp- singing on the battlefield uh, to end wars or something, and win battles or somehow. Um, yeah, uh, so so it's also the title of um, of that that song. Uh, yeah, and Speaking it's kind of, of weird. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so just um, speaking. Speaking of singing for a second to like to like defeat like main bosses. Um. I was um. I was also reminded of like Cross Angie, where they they also sing. <laughs> oh God! Don't well. remind me of this show. Sure. Yeah. But um, <laughs> what like one of like um some something I I picked up on or 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 something I found a bit like weird. Um. Is like just like watching like animated characters sing. It it it's always a little bit um, uncanny. Um, it it never quite like fits right. I mean, I think there's certain very specific examples where it it, it looks okay, but um, I just I just thought all the all the scene just looked kind of weird. Um, <laughs> in this show, it's just um, it didn't like their like mouth movements weren't like connecting with with the sounds being played. Um, I don't yeah, know. and and n- not just their mouth movement, uh, not not just. Vivi's mouth movements, but but also like uh, the way that she moves her body, it's like um, like I don't know, like like a, like she's dancing rather than singing. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, uh, yeah, and uh, f- fluorite. Uh, I looked it up. Uh, is uh, s- some some kind of mineral, green blue uh, mineral, which is used um, in. Um, to make camera camera lenses, um, and uh, interesting. Okay. yeah, uh, and the the creators of this anime have a thing with uh, like um, showing the uh, uh, having still shots with uh, the 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 camera lenses inside the eyes of the AI um, AI characters, um, and uh, it it looks nice, but uh, sometimes it's a bit like. They, because it it just goes from hyper detail to like 
Uh, yeah, no. yeah. <laughs> it's like it's it's like a very sort of like dark SpongeBob episode. <laughs> um. Yeah, it looks nice though, and uh, I'll probably it's, if yeah, I can it, find it. It does look nice, and, and sometimes in this sort of higher detailed mode, that they do um, add add a bit of animation um, as well. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like at the end when when the lights go out um, in Vivi's eyes, I think. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So yeah, we talked about uh, that was the first first one and uh, the first arc because it's it's all pretty neatly put in, into small arcs. Um, I'll, I'll need a Vivi. <laughs> Can't remember. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, I I I believe the next one is um, Estella's arc. In like the uh, spaceship, like like the space cruise. Oh yeah, yeah, um, yeah. Because, uh, and I can't remember how many years later that was supposed to be. Something like ten or fifteen years later. Yes, yeah, something like uh, that. Um, I don't really remember. I, I, all all I can as as for as for how the um, time skips work. All all I, all I can remember is is uh, at some point like there's like a thirty year time skip, but um, I have no idea which <laughs> which um, part of the series that. that that occurs in, um, so I don't know. It it doesn't really, it doesn't really matter that much. All you have to know is that they're going forward in time, um, really. Yeah, um, and and that, uh, and that like technology is like slowly um, improving. Um, yeah. So yeah, like as a result of them like saving the uh, politician, um, it sort of it kind of it kind of does like like the the opposite of what they wanted it to. Um, instead of like um slowing down like AI development, um, AI just gets starts improving at, at a faster rate um yeah so you, like you sort of like you know there's there's this sort of like as like a viewer you start sort of maybe doubting a massive um doubting a matsumoto sort of kind of early on like like does does this ai like know what he's doing you know um or not but um yeah, I mean, yeah. He's, also, he's, also, he's, also, he's also like comic relief as well um so you, you sort of get this impression that they could like they could fail, you know, yeah, which, which, which is pretty good, you know. Um, yeah. Uh, uh, did you uh, did you uh, find uh, any, any of the like? Yeah. Did you find uh, Matsumoto like annoying? <laughs> Not really, no. no I, okay. You found if you you found him annoying? And, like uh, sometimes, like sometimes he would just like talk like like really like really fast, and uh, I don't know. It was kind of it was kind of like a bit irritating. And um, he just like he just wouldn't like shut up sometimes. It's like, <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> yeah. I, I guess, uh, yeah. I guess uh, Vivi would agree with you. Um, I did f- find this. Uh, um, so at, at the start of ev- every uh, new arc, uh, like they will let's they will let's play in like um, basically h- um, how they have failed <laughs> um, after yeah. pre- prevent- <laughs> preventing AI from um, improving. And um, I, I I found it a bit funny that like the politician was. Uh, like he he was moved by like s- s- like what Vivi said, which, which was something like it's it's not about how uh how you die, it's about <laughs> how you continue to live or, or something. Yeah, I should just say that. Yeah, yeah. And they, yeah. Like, it's, like it's something <laughs> very d- deep. <laughs> yeah, she just she, she just sort of says this like platitudes, and then it's like this like really like dramatic, but but like, she, 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 like Stands up at the same time, you know. She like, you know, like, like some like I don't know, like it's like it's like some like girl boss moments where she looks like she she like throws throws like a like Gerda off herself, and then she's like, it's not it's it's not how we die, it's it's how we live. <laughs> and then and then like the politician is like, OMG, I love her so much. Um, and then um, but yeah, that 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 that. That seems to work for him. So, um, anyway, yeah. Um, I mean, to, to be fair, to be fair to, to Matsumoto, um, at the end uh, they do explain why all of, all of his plans uh, failed because uh, yes, yes, they yeah. do. Yeah, the, uh, yeah. The, the archive knows. Yeah, yeah, the, the, the archive knows. Um, uh, one thing I, I do think was was a missed opportunity is very quickly, uh, Matsumo- um, very quickly uh, Matsumoto um, changes. From like being inside like a teddy bear, um, and he ch- and um, he turns into a cube basically. Um, halfway through the series, I thought this was like a missed opportunity. I think like the visual of like um of like Vivi carrying around 
a like teddy bear you know i I feel that like sort of played into like her like idol um, aesthetic quite well (laughs) like i thought i thought they should have just like kept with that like i kind of thought like it was sort of, it was sort of late. He just turns into in, into a cube halfway through. Um, I kind I kind of like that teddy bear, just just like wandering around. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. By by the way, um, so one of the ways which uh, they use uh, to keep track of how much AI has um, come forward, uh, improved, uh, whatever, is uh, the tower where the archive um, is, which is called um, Akarasashi or something, uh, which is sup- supposed to be. Um, the eighth level of consciousness in Buddhism, or something. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yo. Yeah. Wh- whatever. Anyway. Um, yeah. So. T- yeah. Um, yeah. So uh, anyway, the uh, the next arc is um, bl- and belongs to uh, Estella. It's about. Um, so um, in the original timeline, it was um, alleged that um, Estella, who's like a um, AI, um, what's the word? She's like she's a um, not not like service. Um, well, like, she's sort of like a service. Lifekeeper um, or something. I think I think uh, the th- the term which they used uh, was lifekeeper. Uh, yeah, she's a uh, hospitality um, AI. That's the word. Yeah. Um, uh, but um, the story goes that she goes rogue and she ends up crashing um, this like space cruise into the planet, <laughs> and everyone dies basically. Um, I don't, I don't really know what what the ramifications of that were. Um, I can't quite remember, but um, either way, it leads to the acceleration. It, it leads to the acceleration development of AI. Um, I'm, yeah, I, to, to be honest, I, I wasn't really sure. I don't think that they, they did a good job of of explaining like why it would be a bad thing for um, like for that accident to have to happen, and then people people would be against AI. But that's a bad thing somehow. Um, yeah. Um... I don't know. Yeah, they don't really explain that. Uh, but yeah, I mean, um, I, f- I, I do think the like mystery aspect of this part was good though, because um, you're not really sure if, she, if she's gonna like snap it, you know, if she's gonna snap at any moment or not. And when she does, it turns out that she wasn't her; it was her uh, identical twin sister, um, aka yeah, and, and, yeah. a model <laughs> that that was made at the same time as her. If yeah, you, but. Um, but but yeah. the, the funny thing is, is, is when the identical twin sister at the end ends, ends up having a clone as well. Um, yes, yes, <laughs> a, a a clone of a clone. <laughs> yeah. Though we're, um, though we're in in like the <clears throat> in the data world, it wouldn't make any, any difference. Um, the whole point is that you can just copy over data without, without there being any uh, losses. So but, uh, I never, I never really bought into yeah. like why would like why would sending like training training data from, from like one ai not working like another ai i don't i don't know it's kind of um it was kind of weird yeah because yeah so it didn't work then but then but then it worked when they when talk cloned cloned them yeah no <laughs> so that's weird yeah. One. um yeah the, the mystery was okay and uh um yeah the mystery was okay they find the culprits yeah it is a it is a mist it was a mystery i didn't think about it but yeah <laughs> um and uh yeah uh, um um the sister you know given that you said that they keep on bring, bringing up uh momoha um uh the girl that died on the in the air, air crash um in this episode it comes up in the form of um the sister her, of um, of that girl uh, uh, whom um, uh, Bibi just uh, randomly comes across. Um, um, yeah, the, the ship. They just come across each other. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, and obviously they come they come across um, uh, Toak uh, as well because this this was another another one of their plans. Um, yeah, uh, not much else to say about that. Um, yeah, I mean it, uh, that arc sort of ends with, um, if, if if I'm asking work, um, with um, Estella kind of being uh, vindicated, um, or sort of like her, her memory being saved. Um, so she ends up being a mate, um, being uh, remembered as sort of like a savior <clears throat> of of the um, like passengers of the um, cruise, and you know, again, like the. That sort of, like the effect effect of this change again sort of has the opposite um, opposite outcome that 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 they want. 
um, I think um, there, are, there, are, there are points where like no development happens, or it's or maybe even like development goes backwards. I can't quite remember, but for some reason it's not it's not very consistent really. It's kind of arbitrary. Um, I think I think the changes are kind of arbitrary on purpose uh, because they're they're not really changing anything. Um, they just sort of think they that they are, you know. Yeah, I mean, uh, the archive so, sort of says that the same um, thing at the end, right? That like no matter what you changed, uh, the outcome we were going to destroy humanity anyway, or something like that. It was going yeah. to end up like that uh, anyway. Is it some, um, is it some Ophelia next? The like very very young um, idol robot, or is it something else before that? I can't quite remember. Let me see. So ensemble for Polaris. Our promise. As vivid in eyes, being diva to Yuzuka. Oh no, that's still that's still the same. That 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 arc lasted two episodes. Well, uh, isn't yeah, it, uh, isn't isn't the next arc um, about the islands? Um, where it's it's like it's like, it's like the first um, like AI constructed um, islands. Um, and it, and then there's no, and then there's yeah. a guy. Uh, the, the metal float. <clears throat> the metal float island. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, the metal float island. Um. <laughs> Yeah, there, there, there was, uh, I don't know, like, is that, maybe I'm reading too much into it, but there, there was something like um, in the relationship between um, the the scientist, what was his name, um, Tatsuya and Grace, because T- Tatsuya ma- actually made Grace uh, the AI um, nurse um, that, Okay. Yeah. We had to even start explaining this. Uh... Yeah. So um, a man, a man marries his sex doll, basically. Uh, no, 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 no. Sorry, sorry. A, um... <laughs> yeah. And uh... so it it starts. Well, I, I don't know which. I, I don't remember this very well. Um, it's sort of it's all like sort of blurred into one. This story arc. I could barely, I could barely remember it. But uh, all all I really remember very well is like the um, R two D two robots who like torpedo the like who um, torpedo into a boat um but um <clears throat> so there's there's a scientist man uh but i have no idea what he's called um Tatsuya. is it okay Tats- so a tusky Tats- uh, Saiki. i think yeah uh, so, they just okay. called him they just called him dr Saiki for most of the time okay so uh, doc- dr Saiki. he's um he's the first um human to get married to an ai right um so when um, he's um he's married to an ai um called called grace um, which I don't know. I think I I honestly think the 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 whole um, message of that of, of this arc is, is just to like find a, a like real woman and not like marry a like robot. It didn't it doesn't it doesn't seem to work out too well for him. But um, his um, marriage is robots and he, but um, I think he's in charge of, of overseeing the like metal flat or something. I can't really remember. But um, he he he's connected to. That that project because um Grace because the Grace is with isn't the real Grace she is a copy of the real Grace and that Grace is like the central um core uh, like, yeah da- like the data center of the of like of like the metal floats right because I don't know she was she, she was with, like a really good AI uh, so they decided to make her like I, a, I yeah, think, a like, data center I think <laughs> I think, uh, I think the, the explanation was is that. Uh, Grace is what one of the quote unquote sisters um to um to Vivi and to, to Estella and because Estella ended up uh, saving those people um they t- the people thought that uh, the sister models or whatever were the were the best thing uh the best uh, AI or whatever all oh, right okay. <laughs> yeah okay. so that that that's why and apparently among them Grace was the uh yeah, uh, the most caring or whatever. Uh, so they chose her to run this uh, automated uh, factory, I guess, AI factory city. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And I don't, yeah. I don't think that, that like, um, uh, they are not married um, yet in this um, in this timeline. Um, no. He, oh, okay. Like, okay. Uh, um, he, he, basically, the, the moment that uh, he proposes to her, he get, uh, he gets a phone call. Saying, oh right. Oh right. Yeah. Say that oh we we need to, to take take Grace um so so basically in in a way it's, it's all um it's all uh, Vivi's fault because Vivi pre- uh, prevented uh, uh, that help because Vivi helped Grace uh, and which caused uh, 
um, uh, Saiki and Grace to die. Uh, yeah, so that's that's what it is. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So they're um, this time of Vivi um, and the Matsumoto's mission is to is to like disable the island. Um, for, um, but um, for, um, for for obvious reasons, um, Doctor Do- Do- Saiki is up for this, and his and he's already prepared a like virus or like shutdown mechanism um, to do so. Um, so he, he he gives that to them um, because um, he like he wants to like he wants to um, he wants to um, um, to um, retrieve his girlfriend, his like robot girlfriend from the island. So it ma- it makes a lot of sense that that he would want to help them shut down the island. Um, so they um, they um, succeed in doing this. Um, there's there's a bit of fighting because. Um, because oh, a like uh, older a yeah a like older um um it, 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 like a um interferes like I I can't say these people's fucking names I, I do apologize <laughs> but um yeah like he, he he interferes um he doesn't really have much of like an impact other than he sort of like loses his mind over the fact that uh, that like Vivi is like interfering like um, um again in like one of his operations uh. Yeah, um, and then, but yeah, this 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 like ends with basically Vivi punching um Grace in the uh, breasts, um, um, and killing her. <laughs> this then this then causes um the, the doctor to then kill himself because he like because you know no no robot GF then why even live um and yeah and that and that basically ends the arc. Yeah. Um, but yeah. um, but like Vivi, Vivi sort of recognises that she caused this, so she has like a breakdown, <laughs> and she, and which causes her to lose her memories. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> like she, she has human blood in one hand, and yeah. whatever blue color. Of, yeah, of yeah, yeah. She, blood she has the, uh, she has like the red and blue pill, and she, and she doesn't want to <laughs> pick one. Uh, yeah, she she took both, uh, and yeah, she went insane. Yeah. <laughs> She lost her memory and became a different person. Uh, yeah, uh, I think uh, I guess we could explain uh, a bit of the backstory with uh, Doctor Saiki. Uh, so, I uh, basically when he was a kid, he, uh, his mother left him or something and went abroad with a with a new family, probably married some other man or, or, or something like that, and uh, he and he was left in the care of uh, this uh, nurse AI um, back when he was a kid. And uh, then he, he came to meet uh, her later later on. And yeah, that, that's basic, basically it. Um, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, next, uh, yeah, so ne- the next arc yeah. is... The next uh, arc is, is um, um, Ophelia's arc, right? Um, because um, Vivi... Oh, yeah, I, I think we should... We should... Spend yeah. at this point, um, that's so Vivi and Diva are, are, the, are the same character basically, um, but they're separate, right? So like, <laughs> they they um, both exist inside inside the same AI, you know. But um, I think in like episode seven, like um, I don't know, like um, it's it's sort of um, established that, that that there's like two entities in her. What is Vivi? Um, I think she. That aspect of her can't sing, um, but like sh- that that carries the sort of desire to like find out like what it means to have like a heart or something. I I don't I'm not really sure. <laughs> and then and then and then the, the other half is like Diva, which is like the actual like idol AI, um, who can like who um knows how to sing basically. Um, and, and so there's like a, se- a separation there. Yeah. Um, but uh... but anyway. Um, yeah, so you can you can just sort of use these names um, interchangeably. Um, yeah. So yeah. So, so ba- ba- yeah. Basically, uh, Vivi, as um, Momoka, the little girl uh, that we talked about at the start, uh, she uh, had a had a, some kind of a, a holographic picture book for children where uh, there was a, some sort of a Disney princess type character called Vivi, and so uh, because that character looked similar. Uh, to D- uh, to Diva, she started she started calling uh, calling uh, 
calling uh D- so because D- D- uh, <laughs> Vivi's original name was Divad uh, Divad the, the name that was given to her by her creator or whatever was Diva. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah, so, clarified. Nothing. So <laughs> but, just 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 to clarify, a um, small girl makes Diva schizophrenic. Okay, <laughs> which causes a split personality in Diva um, called Vivi, and that's basically no, that's, I, I, that's I basically think, like what's going on. I mean, isn't it the other way around? It isn't. Uh, so, because <laughs> is, is, isn't Vivi the original personality, and and Diva is after? <laughs> I don't know. Let, let's let's just move on. Anyway, moving on. So, um, yeah. so, so, with, so with Vivi, um, Diva loses her memories, um, after after the red blue, um, after 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 the red pill blue pill, um, event, and um, she sort of um defaults to just being Diva. Um, she's like super. Um, she, she's like a megastar and um, idol now at this point. Um, I think it's it's been about sixty years since she was first um, since she was first built or, or something. And yeah. so um, you can you can sort of pick up on how she's kind of like more uh, mature now at, at this point because it's been so many years. Um, but uh, yeah, and she ends up becoming sort of like a um, mentor to this other um, AI called Ophelia. Um, She's like a newer model. Um, who used to have a like stage manager AI, um, <clears throat> and and that stage manager AI was called uh, Antonio, um, who um, who has who has uh, mysteriously gone offline, um, <laughs> or or has just like or, or has just turned off for for some unknown reason, and Ophelia is very sad about this. Um, but um, the reason um, then sort of at the be- you know um, at this point. With all this established, um, we did see Masamoto, sorry, Ma- Matsumoto or, or, or whatever, um, turn up. <clears throat> and the reason why he's turned up is because in the original timeline, um, Ophelia is the first AI to, to like commit suicide. Um, but um, so we, so we, the like first segment of this arc is um, Matsumoto um, trying to bring back um, Vivi because she's lost her memories. Um, yeah. Anyway. Oh man. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So. So yeah. Ma- ma- basically, Matsumoto tries to to stop uh, Ophelia from committing suicide alone, but um, he ends up um, having to save uh, Vivi from uh, uh, K- Katikani. Oh God, I can't remember the name now. I forget. Uh, Yugo, um, it was Katikani, right? I can't remember. Um, who, um, who are you? I'm referring to. <clears throat> oh, right, yeah, the, um, yeah, um, yes, so, Yugo, okay. Yugo. <clears throat> yeah, Yugo. I know, yeah, I know, I know you're talking about. So yes, yes, a Katakani. Um, yeah, yeah, and, who, who um, at this point is like a cyborg. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, an insane uh, cyborg. Uh, yeah, uh, but I like. Um, so basically, the, what, what happens is uh, is that it's reveal, revealed that uh, um, actually uh, a- Antonio just uh, took over um, Ophelia's body, uh, but uh, I, I'm not exactly sure why he did. Yeah, this. I'm not sure either. <laughs> my my. my... The best um, idea of why um, is that is, is that so Antonio just wanted um, Ophelia to sing for him, um, and so the way he did this is to like take over her body. Um, but even then, that doesn't really make much sense because even though he's taken over her like body, he, he still like sings. To, he still sort of like uses her like voice to sing to everyone. But as so I, I don't know, it's um, it's weird. It's, it's, yeah, it's like. It's like he has just gone insane, uh, and he doesn't really know why he yeah, took over. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. And there's there's also like a sort of very um, scatter shot fight on the roof as well. Um, I, I don't really know like what's happening. Like, was Antonio trying to like take over like Matsumoto, or was Matsumoto trying to take over Antonio? Or I, I don't <laughs> yeah. know. Well, I don't know what the fuck was going on. <laughs> yeah, it, it was so, sort of like they, they were in a, in a video game and. Uh, uh, the yeah and and, it, and I think it was at this point that uh, or, or maybe even before this no it was before this that uh, um, 
Ma- Matsumoto started to make copies of himself. Oh which... yeah, we um <laughs> we have we haven't talked about the like Minecraft hover um um hover bike yet, have we? <laughs> some of some of the best CGI I've I've ever seen in any anime ever. It's <laughs> so um so uh, yeah, just just for seconds in the previous arc, um before um Vivi punches um punches our oh god um Grace in the uh, tits um. She, she she has to like fly up um into the, the like central hub um but to do this um Matsumoto uh, pulls out a, a trick uh and and that's the um, fact that that he can sort of um influence like a bunch of different objects and he can like combine them into himself and so he he can, he can become like a like blocky construct of of, of anything you know the, okay so like just just like picture like a bunch of blocks being stuck together. Um, that can fly as well, and also can like shoot lasers and stuff. Um, uh, and yeah, so like Ma- so like Masamoto can like make himself bigger. He can sort of um do more things than he would usually just just as like a s- single cube in his multi cube body um form. So yeah, like um, so he um he makes a, a comeback um in this arc where he transforms into like a, like some like quadrupedal robots um. And and he like wrestles. Um, <laughs> he wrestles. Um, oh God, uh, Antonio. Yes, yes. Um, and, because uh, Antonio is being controlled remotely from um, Ophelia, um, who is who yes, is um, in turn possessed by Antonio. <laughs> <laughs> and, and and at the same time, uh, as this is as, as this is going on, uh, Matsumoto he has a bunch of other cubes uh, helping with uh, uh, the fight with. Um, Oh yeah, uh, yeah. Cyborg. Yeah. I thought I, I thought that I thought the uh, fight between um, Vivi and uh, Hugo was much better actually. <laughs> um, it was um, it, it made them a lot, like I could follow like what was going on in that fight um, a lot better. Um, anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I I think the 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 silliest thing in in the fight with um, Antonio was when like um, Matsumoto couldn't. S- step on c- certain uh, squares. Yeah, like tiles. <laughs> yeah, th- yeah, yeah. He was uh, he was played like Twister or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because he, if he did, then he would he would he would get infected. Um, yeah, he would. Some... Yeah, he would. He would get hacked. <laughs> I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I was like, well, what if is going on here? Has like has like Antonio like put like I don't know like has he like rigged like the like entire roof of this building? With like I don't know, like electronics that like hack you if if you stand in the wrong place. So I don't know. It's kind of I have no <laughs> idea. Is it like like we are seeing inside? Like it's it's a mind battle or something that we are seeing inside their heads. But uh, from from the outside, it actually all looks normal. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it, it does well. I don't know. It was it, it was very weird. I, I I didn't really know what was, what was happening. Um, I, I think I said it. Oh god! Yeah. And, yeah. Uh, it was it, it was uh, funny though. It's, I don't know. <laughs> and K- K- Kakitani uh, reveals that he he received some uh, revelation, uh, which it turns out it was just the the archive um, um, from had I don't know if I don't know if it's the archive from the future or not or whatever. Um, but but the archive okay. had um, yeah. Uh, told him how to basically get back Vivi's personality uh, f- forty years ago or something. Um, because I, th- I think yeah, there's a forty year um, yeah th- um, time gap um, here. And b- but uh, it's not just Antonio's motiv- motivations which are not clear. Um, um, like it, it also wasn't exactly clear what the hell Kahitani wanted from. Um, Vivi. So he wanted to bring Vivi back so that um, he could ask uh, whether his teacher felt uh, bad like a human would when uh, uh, when his teacher tried to save him um, from a burning car and then it ended up uh, uh, getting blown up into pieces. Uh, the, the funeral was a little bit funny. Um, <laughs> yeah. You know... <laughs> Because like um, he he says he, he says that like um, 
Um, so at, at the funeral for, for the um, for the robot, which taught Kakitani how to play play the piano or whatever his teacher, uh, they they play back the the footage uh, from his death. Um, and then um, Kakitani says that this made made him feel like vomiting, and then it cuts to like him actually vomiting at at the funeral. <laughs> so yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, so um, yeah, and at the end, Kakitani uh, is able to infect um, Diva with the uh, with a virus which restore uh, which erases uh, Diva's personality and restores um vivi um but then uh, for some reason vivi can't uh, sing any anymore after this, uh because she's still traumatized i guess from uh, having killed um, um dr saiki and grace and now she wants to know she keeps she wants to know i i'm not sure whether it is at this point that they reveal that um uh, vivi's cre- uh, creator um gave him uh, gave her um also the task of um the mission because yeah uh, yeah that, that's another thing which we didn't talk about that uh, uh which they explain at the start of the series is, is that in, in this setting every uh ai has to have uh one mission uh only maximum um but it's i don't know it's kind of vague um because uh obviously uh and anyway uh what was i saying uh, I, don't, I, I, I don't know. Like, um, yeah, I mean, it's kind of interesting, yeah, you know, because a, a AI can, can can have one mission, but the mission can also be very vague as well. So, you know, and uh, apparently, like they like AIs also have a lot of freedom with how they uh, sort of, can sort of operate. Like, um, Vivi can just sort of go off on these adventures, and that still counts as her like f- um, fulfilling her mission. You know, so I don't know. They can. They can they're also allowed to make these like logical um sort of steps if you like, no operate under uh, yeah. wider conditions and, you know and and and, and, and the uh, ultimate logical step is um like kill all the humans i guess for for the archive uh, be- because i think uh, so the archives mission was something like promote human evolution or something so we just we, the humans are not evolving so we just kill all the humans and become the the new humans, <laughs> and, then, and then and then that that uh, that will count as um, humans evolving, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I, I don't know. Like, uh, <laughs> I guess. Um, yeah. So I mean, there's there's lots of sort of broken logic in in, in this show um, with like like how AIs sort of come to weird conclusions. Um, they don't really make a lot of sense, really. But um, at least, at least the one thing that does make sense is how they, how uh, like Vivi and Matsumoto weren't able to change the, the future, and it's because um, throughout all the time they they weren't aware that they were being um, opposed by the um, what's it called, like like like, like the mainframe, the uh, like the, the um, archive. yeah yeah yeah. Thank you. The the archive. Um, and and it it also makes sense that um, no matter sort of uh, no matter um, no matter how many times they would go backwards and forwards in time, um, they would they would never beat the archive because I mean like well f- firstly they don't really know that the archive is against them but also secondly the, the archive w- sort of would w- would just have more processing power anyway than uh, Matsumoto and Vivi any so there wouldn't really be much they could do um they would sort of always lose uh, because the archive is is such a you know is is so big brains. The, it would just be able to like think around and um, get the outcome it wants anyway. Um, but yeah, I, I, and sort of at at this point, I was thinking, right? So uh, and and this is like this this is like the the uh, the finale of of, of the series. Um, and where um, like um, Vivi, um, I th- actually I think I think we we should explain how um, how a Vivi gets a um, virus at the um, at the end of the Ophelia arc. Um, which causes basically um, the diva part of her to get erased, right? Um, because of a virus or, or or something, so she loses her ability to be able to um, sing, right? Um, so, so so she ends up getting sort of decommissioned, and um, she's she's put into a, a museum. Um, when she and she's been in this museum for like a, f- a few decades, 
Um, but um, in the museum, she meets his kid, um, who is called um, who um, happens to be um, Doctor Matsumoto, right? Um, but um, he's just um, he's just called um, he's just called um, Osamu at this point because you know he's just a kid, and, and that's how, and that's how Vivi knows him. Uh, and so this this final arc is basically um, watching um, Osamu grow up, him getting a family, um, then like. Um, when like Vivi, um, he's like he's like holding his, his uh, kids, right? Um, she sort of, she sort of asks, um, a Samu like, um, I, I mean, it's kind of, it's kind of bad that I can't remember this, but um, she asks about like his wife who's who died, right? And he gives an answer that causes her to, to um write the first AI um written song, right? I think it was something like uh, uh, even if, even if people die, uh, they still live on other other people's memories. So my wife still lives on oh, in oh, my yeah. memory. Yeah, and yeah, I, I think yeah. The, the the reason why um, that sort of uh, tri- trigger server was that um, uh, like sh- she kept on asking, um, especially after uh, the diva part was erased. Uh, like, what, what does it mean to put your heart into something? And she also kept on asking that before because apparently that's something which uh, her creator put into uh, her um, as, I don't know, uh, a bonus mission or something uh, <laughs> other than uh, just m- making people happy with song. Um, and um, uh, at the very end, she comes to the conclusion that um, uh, I don't, exactly know how but like um that by heart uh she means um uh, the memories uh, that she has had with other people uh it means putting her, her uh, heart into it uh, or something into me into something into singing um yeah uh so um you can continue from where i interrupted you i guess <laughs> yeah so she manages to make um or, or compose the first ai um, song, um, or the or, or the first song ever made by AI, and what is meant by that is at this at, at, at this point there's been that like over a um, hundred thousand songs made by AI, but those are all produced because a like human told them to do it. Um, but um, Vivi wants to make this song off like off her, her, her own accord, and that will be the first time this occurs. Um, the um. God, I keep, I keep I keep forgetting the the yes the archive sort of sees this as a um a like um development in AI a a, a very significant one and for, and for this reason the, the archive puts puts um a lot of um stock in Vivi's choices and and what she does at this point um but anyway um she she writes this song um but when when she does so. I don't. I think it's sort of unclear if this causes, if her writing this song causes all AIs to suddenly like chimp out and like kill everyone, or if it, or if it, it happens for a different reason. But um, need, like need, needless to say, after um after she writes the song, she she, she comes back um into in, into consciousness um as it were, um and um she finds that like the apocalypse has happened, what she was working to avoid has occurred, and all the AIs have turned on the humans. And um, the, um, yeah, but um, what's happening um, this time um, is that is that they're the all sort of si- singing her song, right? Um, they're um, they're singing her song because um, oh my god, this 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 is so difficult to explain. Right? <laughs> but um, they're singing their song because um, the AIs are using it to prove that they can be um, that they have that they have uh, imagination, right? Um, which is something like that humans have that AIs lack. Um, but Vivi, Vivi writing this song proves that AIs can have imagination, right? So all the AIs are seeing it to but prove this, right? Um, um, so anyway, um, Vivi manages to um, not save a guy. Uh, he, he gets like run over by like a taxi, <laughs> and um, she finds like the like resistance, the, the, like, the like Terminator resistance movement. Um, and they go um, to destroy the archive or, 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 or like the main hub where the archive is. Um, at this point, I'm thinking, well, they don't really have a chance, right? Because at this point, it, it, it's been established that the archive 
it can sort of see the future. It can predict every outcome. So it doesn't really matter what they do. They will never be able to defeat the archive, right? Um, but this is explained, right? Um, this, this is explained because of what the archive wants, um, because of the role the archive wants Fury to play. Um, so they break in. Um, the league sort of um, confronts the archive, and um, the archive uh, um, asks asks him, Vivi, well, if you want to save, um, um, if you want to save um, humanity, then you 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 like have to sing for um, for me, right? Um, on the first time around, Vivi isn't able to do this, and so basically, um, all the satellites the archive has set to um, crash into the earth does crash into like does crash into the earth and everyone is sort of wiped out um but um vivi however uh, vivi like manages to travel in time a little bit so she's like able to like save more, sort of more, more people and then finally with with uh, how, and, and 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 this is how the show ends she's able to um like um deliver her a performance um without without um like that that like diva part of her personality presence, um. So she's just singing as Vivi, you know, from from her heart, um, as um, as it were. So she's able to like save, um, she's able to uh, save humanity, um. But um, in doing this, she obviously um, this also kills her, like uh, when like when she does this, because I think the archive shuts down and she's connected to some um in in some way. So <laughs> so the show like basically ends. Um, or you sort of uh, at least think it ends with her like dying, um, her, her like powering down. Um, the, the the archive is is defeated, or it it's um it agrees not to kill all of humanity because Vivi says, um, it um humanity shouldn't like shouldn't be uh, destroyed, and that and that's basically how the show ends. I I I'm, I'm missing some details here, but I'll try to explain in in, in like the most clearest way I can. <laughs> um, there's, yeah, a, there's yeah. only a little bit more left of the plot to. Explain after this but you know yeah yeah um i think the archive is destroyed by um because they the um, matsumoto uses the um uh, the ai personality erasing program um that was used on uh, on diva uh, on on the archive um yeah and Mats- i think matsumoto also dies <laughs> while trying to save um save um, uh, vivi from a, a falling satellite because um i don't know m- maybe the archive or, uh, just by accident um uh, because much more is able to prevent most of the satellites from falling but one one is falling towards um uh, uh, land um and um uh Matsumoto flies towards it and it explodes in the in the sky while um uh Vivi is singing um yeah uh what else is there to say um did you did you like the banter between uh matsumoto and uh Vivi? I'm sure it was okay you know it was a little it, i mean it was at the same time it, it was a like a like discussion between like a i s so it was a bit stilted um plus like Asian humor is a little bit different. Um, it doesn't always land sort of naturally, um, <laughs> so I kind of I thought it was okay, but it it, it wasn't like great. Um, yeah, I um to me, uh, Vivi's character sort of um, reminded me a, a bit of uh, Dorothy from The Big O, but not as funny, I guess. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, I get yeah. that. Well, it, there's a, there's um a I was actually um, um, reminded of, of of The Big O um for a brief time because um. There's a like line um she says um as as diva she says like 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 never refer like never talk about the like mass or um like age of a AI model um to them you know and I, and I, and I was thinking of that like of that like that um scene in the O where like Dorothy gets into like the lift and she's like too heavy for for, for the lift and so she has to just like you you just stairs instead and she and she like berates um. Yeah. The yeah the guy um, later on about that I, I don't know that was that was kind of um, yeah that that um, was when I, I was um, reminded um, God what's he called I forget like literally the main character of the big O I, I forgot I forgot who he's called uh, anyway yeah, sorry I can, yeah. <laughs> I 
can't remember the the negotiator. Let, let's call him that. Yeah, yeah, he, uh, he, he was he was. Uh, I believe the negotiator. <laughs> but yeah, um, um, yeah. Speaking of names, I thought that uh, Singularity Project is sort of an uninspired name for that. That's what they call their mission to uh, prevent yeah. The, yeah AI from taking. Yeah, which which uh, makes like kind of a sense, but not really. I don't know. <laughs> like um, in theory, they would have sort of already achieve the singularity um in sort of in, in technical terms but I, I i'm not sure um and uh, at least at least at least at least they did quite like judgment day or something <laughs> so so uh fahrenheit uh, w- w- what does uh, putting your heart into something mean to you fahrenheit <laughs> um hmm. yeah moving on um oh, oh yes yeah. we need um we we, we we need to talk about the very last after um after credit scene um where um viv like um viv viv wakes up um and she's um, she she's in like a new body um her her hair is, is uh, shorter and she and she she like looks out of the window there's like a bunch of children like playing and smiling um in like these sort of like apocalyptic um, wastes of uh, of like post um singularity um and it, and 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 then that's actually where when a series ends, so it turns out that that, that Vivi didn't die after all, and everyone lives happily ever after, apart from the like billions of people who were probably killed by AI. But uh, okay. let's, let's not talk about that. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. So, um, uh, how how would you rate this series? I would um, I would say it's it's, it's a seven. Um, it's good, um, but it it does have its flaws. Um, it does it does fall into certain pitfalls. Um, but it is pretty decent though at the same time. So yeah, I think a seven is a good score. Yeah, yeah, I would I would give it a seven point five, uh, because I enjoyed it. But um, yeah, I guess it didn't really do anything new that I haven't seen before. Um, it was sort of like a short story, kind of felt like. Um, yeah, um, it did. It did. Um, it was good. I'm glad. I'm glad that they didn't. Um, I don't think there was any filler episodes. I mean, it was all fairly um efficient you know um, yeah. in that it did, I, yeah I, I, don't know. I think th- there's um there's um a re- recap episode uh, which they made after they finished the series um and i think it was made because uh, um to sell along with uh, the soundtrack um and it it's 23 minutes long and it's supposed to be a summary of how that um uh, yeah uh, i I didn't think about it till now, but um, I, I guess th- this series does have something in common with um, with the other series by this author, uh, ReZero. Um, there's time travel. Yeah, yeah. Uh, ReZero is basically time travel. All, all, uh, all um, I know about ReZero is that um, there's like time travel and the main character like suffers a lot, um, and there's also like there's like there's like these, these like maid girls, and everyone like argues over like who's the best. Um, I don't know. Yeah. Um there hasn't been a new season in a while. Um yeah. Um uh, would say I don't know. It's this underrated, maybe. I, don't, I, I never I never heard of it, so like um I've never seen anyone like talk about this. Um Yeah. So I guess uh I guess we can thank uh, Gigak for the recommendation. <laughs> uh, yes, so thank for, thank you, Gigak. Very cool. Um yeah. Uh, can you think of any similar series? Um, the one that sort of immediately came to mind was um, the one we were talking about earlier. It's um, oh god, um, time of time of Eve. Um, but it's not. I, I, they both sort of explore AIs to to a, a, an extent, but um, I I wouldn't advise anyone to watch Time of Eve because um, it's it's pretty bad. But um. <laughs> um this is I don't know like this was sort of um, unique in its own way, but um none, none of the um components did it were um, like unique. It was it was sort of like a um, unique um combination of of um well um of of well walked aspects, you know. Yeah. Um. I guess for the time travel thing, there's St- Steins Gate, but Steins Gate is so is just about. Uh, time travel, whereas this is more more about artificial intelligence with uh, time travel being like a secondary thing. Yeah. 
Uh, some people are recommending I see uh, Violet Evergarden, but I haven't seen that. Um, yeah. Uh, anything else to add? Um, no. <laughs> if you were, yeah. um, if you like um, like sci-fi shows with, um, I don't know. If you if you, if you just want to see something decent that's came out very recently, then maybe you should think about watching this show. Um, yeah. This show was released in like 2021, um, so it was very recent. Um, but yeah, it was um, it was also very surprising. Um, I kind I kind of just assume like that that's uh, like most most of anime coming out is sort of uh, like trash. But uh, <laughs> yeah, anyway. <laughs> yeah, I I, th- I think I don't think we did a good job a good job of explaining why it's not trash. Um, <laughs> because we just went over the plot. Um, let me think. Uh, yeah, it's got it's got it's got it's got good writing. You know, it's got good emotional plot points. It's um. It's split up nicely into arcs that that are very neatly, um, um very neatly sort of um, executed. Um, I mean, it is it doesn't overstay its welcome either. You know? Yeah, pretty much. That's uh, that sums it up. Um, so I'll end the stream there, right? Uh, so that's the end of the stream. Uh, yeah, I think I think it went all right. Well, it wasn't a stream, but the recording, I yeah. guess. That's the end of the recording. Um, is the Craig? St- should we kick Craig? Yeah, you can. Keep. Mm. I I recorded the, the whole thing on uh, OBS as well, so it's fine. Uh-uh. Get Craig. Wait a minute. Um, it's it's not it's not kick. It's it's disconnect. <laughs> 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 <laughs>